Okay, so I just got my Blue Bento watercolor paint box. Well, this has many different colors that you can use to paint in, like my sketch of the flower and grass in here. And there's different spaces for you to fill it in, like if you want to mix your own color, you can save them right here. Or you can have another one to save a different color that you had before. And I'm just going to paint in my picture of a flower with the grass. And first I'm going to do the grass with the water. And then after I'm finished with the grass, I am going to color in the flower a red. I'll paint it in red. And then I'll paint in the inner part of the flower the lemon yellow. It looks a little bit brighter. So I mixed my own color. I made it a little dark, like a dark orange and red mix. And um, I'm going to be using this red from over here. The cadmium red hue, acadium red hue, and I'm gonna color in the outer petals of the flower. And the stem will actually be a different green from the grass, it will be more like a green brown mix. And the colors are actually pretty good because they can help you with, uh, if you wanted to like color in a drawing but you thought like a crayon wouldn't work that good, then you could just use the paint. And um, it has a, well the paintbrush, that comes with it, um, it's good because it's skinny, and if you had a fat one, you couldn't get in skinny places, but the skinny paintbrush can also, um, get all the small details in to the flower or, like, any drawing that you have. So, this was... A good this was a good um thing to have right now and the colors so now that I've um finished my picture I'm probably gonna hang it up on the wall and um I suggest the Blue Bento watercolor paint box because it's re a really good product so you could just look it up on Amazon and get it because I recommend it for all you artists out there.